at noon. The hurricane outlook is out and it is being dubbed the most active season ever issued in April under the current forecasters. Now the WDSU first warning weather department along with Dr. Phil Klotzbach of Colorado State University are digging deep into this report and meteorologist Jim Sion joins us now with why we might be seeing this highly active season. Last season was great because of El Nino, right? This season because of La Nina, which is likely to happen, won't be as great for is us. Is there any way we can just not have that happen? Because <laughs> that's a big stress that a lot of people don't want to deal with just months away from the start of hurricane season. Yes, indeed. Yeah. Well, unfortunately, it looks like this may be an active mm -hmm. season. The latest forecast and here are the numbers for you. And they do look a little dramatic when you glance at it. 14 <laughs> yeah. average storms, 23 in the forecast, according to Dr. Phil. Seven hurricanes on the average, 11 forecast this year, and five of those could be major hurricanes. Now, remember, this is a six-month forecast, and even if it is an above active season, which is likely to happen, we don't know where these storms are going to go. Your hurricane preparations are going to be the same. You know your risk. You have your plan. But let's give you an idea of why we think it's going to be an active season. Last year, we had El Nino warm water off the Pacific, bringing those stronger upper level winds. This year, just the opposite, cooler water, lighter upper level winds, and on top of that, very warm water in the Atlantic as well as the Caribbean. So again, we're prepping for an active hurricane season, but we have a long ways to go. Let's talk about great weather, because that's what we had this morning. We were kind of chilly, actually. We had 41 for the morning temperature in Hammond, 43 in Bogalusa. Check out the temperatures now. We're approaching 70 degrees. Very, very nice with mostly sunny skies. Clouds may increase a bit for us this weekend and a pretty good chance for rain next week. We'll have it all for you coming up right here on WDSU. All right, Jim, thank you for that. Well, new at noon, a former New Orleans priest accused of child sex.